When a person gets a tattoo, doctors say some of that ink doesn't stay in place. In fact, it travels through the body until it finds a home in lymph nodes. KXAN medical reporter Gigi Barnett explains why even though there's no research looking into the side effects, doctors still have a warning about the impacts. About 20 years ago, Mark Hamrick got a tattoo. I met a girl and she uh, inspired me to get a tattoo because I was trying to impress her. The relationship didn't work out. Neither did the hawk dragon scorpion design. So Hamrick burned it off and went back for laser treatment. This little charge would charge and and then uh, and go through each part of the tattoo doing that. You know, that was extremely painful. And uh, I never wanted to do that ever again. It worked, getting rid of the ink on the skin surface. But doctors are now warning that tattoo ink on the inside can linger. That's because the tattoo needle reaches deep beyond the skin surface so the image doesn't fade. As a result, researchers believe about 30% of that ink can travel throughout the body. There have been some documented studies that prove that ink does migrate to the neighboring lymph nodes of a tattoo or to the liver. Dr. Renee Snyder is a board certified dermatologist at St. David's Medical Center. She says migrating ink could cause a problem for patients battling certain illnesses with unexpected discoloration in those glands and organs. The pigment from the tattoo will be in the lymph node and as a clinician, if you don't know that there's a tattoo there, you think it's the cancer and then you cut more skin out than you need to. Snyder suggests patients tell doctors about all of their tattoos, especially the ones that are close to lymph nodes. As for Hamrick, getting another tattoo isn't out of the question. I saw a guy with a really cool tattoo and it, was, it looked like it had a lot of meaning and I was like, oh, that's actually pretty nice. I'm Gigi Barnett, KXAN News. Okay, XAN reached out to about a dozen tattoo parlors and ink supply businesses. We wanted to know just how safe the ink is and which inks can pose a problem for customers. None agreed to discuss this issue on camera.